You ready? Sweet. You ready for the to get into the nerd pop quiz? I am. I am. Let's see how much uh, Godzilla stuff I know. Looking at that list and seeing the monsters. <laughs> I forgot how many cool monsters there are. Yeah, there are some cool ones. Um, I did more recent stuff for the nerd pop quiz just because I feel like I don't know how much of the older Godzillas you watched. I didn't watch consistently all of them. You know, I may have seen some here. I didn't there, watch but... much either. Yeah, so it'll be more of the newer stuff. Okay. Okay, and let me just get this going. So, Nerd Pop Quiz Godzilla Edition. And same as always, you get two points uh, if you get it without the multiple choice. If you need the multiple choice, you get one point if you get it correct. Okay. So, first question. What is the name of the company that primarily makes the Godzilla movies? That's that's a good question. Uh, <laughs> They're like the yeah, ones who the, originally it, made it, and like the newer ones might be made by like Paramount or something, but like they have to get the licenses from this this company. Oh man! So it, it's it, it's a Japanese company, right? It is. Yes. I know it starts with a T. <clears throat> Give me the multiple choice. I, I feel like I'll know it. Okay. Is it? Toho, Toei, Mappa, or UFO Table? Uh, Toho, I believe. Final answer? Eight. Yes. Yep. yep, it is Toho. All right. Yeah. Got that one. You just needed to see it. You you knew it yeah. with the T, so that narrowed it down a little bit. And with that new Godzilla, the minus one, did, when, didn't the Toho logo pop up in the trailer? Or am I tripping? I think so. Okay. I think I remember I think saying where, that. Um, yeah, I think that's where like my brain was thinking of. That's why I thought of yeah, a T. Yeah, it is produced by Toho, so, yep. Cool. Okay, second question. What is Godzilla's name in Japanese? Achua? <laughs> I, <just> got... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Like, uh, multiple choice. Okay. Achua. Is is its name Godzilla, Gojira, Gorira, or Kujira? It's I'm gonna say Isn't it just Godzilla, eh? Or no? We're tripping. Is that your final answer? I feel like it's either A or B, but I'm gonna go with A final answer. Ooh, it is B Gojira. Oh. Yep. I believe oh. it's a combination of the Japanese word for I think gorilla and whale, if I remember correctly. Really? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, interesting choices. Gorilla and I think whale. It just, I think it just sounded cool. Like they, they liked the sound of it, so they went with that. I was gonna say, isn't it more like a lizard? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. In the 2014 movie Godzilla, what is the name that Monarch gives to the primary antagonist monsters? I remember this one. They're Mutos, right? M-U-T-O-S. Yep, uh, final answer. They are Mutos. Mutos, there you go, yeah. Yep. Yeah, yeah the I thought show, that was cool. Yeah, and the show says it a few times, so when I saw that, I was like, yeah, mm -hmm. that's going to help with that question. Yeah. Now, to the follow-up to that. What does MUTO stand for? Ooh. Didn't they say that in the show too, or no? They do, yeah. Yeah, uh, it was... Uh, uh, something unidentified terrestrial organism i have no clue what the m stands for though i okay give me a multiple choice <laughs> okay i don't know what the m stands for these were uh fun to come up with they took a little bit to come up with these so is it monumental unobserved unobserved titanic organism monster of undiscovered type and origin massive unidentified terrestrial organism or modern unknown titan observer Oh, did you come up with all those yourself? Yep, I or did. Not all of them, but well, yeah, ones? besides the actual one, yeah, I came up with the rest of them. Well, I believe it's C, 
massive unidentified terrestrial organism. It yep. is C. Yep. I'm I'm pretty proud of this one, Monster of Undiscovered Type and Origin. I thought that was pretty good. That is good, actually. <laughs> uh, but yeah, nicely done. Okay, where was the first place Godzilla emerged to fight a Muto? This is going back to 2014. Yeah, it was, wasn't it in Cho Tokyo or Japan? Right? Final answer? It is not Japan. No. <clears throat> So oh man, where was it? Here's I'm the gonna need multiple choice. Multiple yeah. choice. So obviously not Japan, like I just said. So is it San Francisco, Las Vegas, or Hawaii? I think it's Hawaii. D. It is Hawaii. Yep. yep. I remember that. San Francisco is the last fight. Yeah. But... Yep. Dang it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, Japan's a good guess. Like most of the time, Godzilla's gonna be fighting in Japan. Yeah, and I felt like the first, I don't know why, I, but now I remember now seeing Hawaii, now that I see it, like, yep. <clears throat> like the water and stuff, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so throughout the movie, or later on in the movie, a second wingless Muto hatches in and attacks what city? Uh, isn't it, isn't it like, uh, isn't it like Albuquerque, New Mexico or something? Final answer? It's not Albuquerque. That's a pretty good guess, though. So I'll bring up the multiple oh, choice. Is it Las okay. Vegas, San Francisco, New York, or Los Angeles? Is it? Oh. Uh, is it Las Vegas, eh? Las Vegas? It is Las Vegas. I think that's yeah. why you were thinking, like, <clears throat> the desert -y yeah. area yeah. kind of thing. Yeah. yeah, you just see it, like... Uh, this is a tough one because you really only see it on like TV screens, or they. I think they show a little bit mm -hmm. of it, but it's not a big like point. Yeah, I think they show most of it like in a desert spot, don't they? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But then yeah. you see some on the TV of it destroying Vegas. That's right. Yeah. Okay. One of the best quotes in this movie, according to Zer Sarazawa, what is the arrogance of man? What is the arrogance of man? So he says, the arrogance of man is blank. The arrogance of man is... Think, Alex, think. Oh. I remember this being a good line, too. Mm -hmm. The arrogance of man is... I'm going to need a multiple choice. <clears throat> yeah, this one is a tough one. So, okay, is it? Is the arrogance of man thinking we can learn from our mistakes? Thinking we are stronger than nature? Thinking nature is in our control? Or thinking we know the meaning of life? I think it's thinking nature is in our control, C. That is correct. Yep. The arrogance of man is thinking nature is in our control. That's a... His delivery on that is so good. Yeah, I really like that line and that. I like that movie, actually, in general. Yeah, I like that movie a lot. Godzilla kills the male Muto by slamming it into a building. How does he kill the female Muto? Is it with his... Atomic Breath? Final answer. Yep, forcing atomic breath down yeah, the throat. Yeah, yeah. That is correct. Yeah, that was such awesome. a great moment. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Slamming her into the same building as her mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that's pretty brutal too. All these are pretty brutal. <laughs> Which monster is the protector of Earth and is friends with two fairies? Now, this wasn't in the movie, the fairy part, but like most of this monster's lore has fairies in mm -hmm. it. Uh, isn't it? Is it not Godzilla? It is not Godzilla. Oh, I'm gonna multiple choice. 
Is it Scylla, Mothra, Bajira, or Rodin? Mothra B? It is Mothra, yes. Yeah, I didn't know that that she's considered the protector of Earth and also has two fairies that, like, speak for her. I had no clue about both either. Because <laughs> yep. well, Mothra was in the second Godzilla movie, yeah, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. What is the name of the pterodactyl-like kaiju that was hatched in Mexico in the 2019 movie Godzilla King of the Monsters? Hmm. Hmm. Give me the multiple choice. Okay. Is this Rodin, Ghidorah, Dagon, Dagon, or Scylla? Man. Yeah, and there were a lot of monsters in that movie, and they weren't shown for that long, so this one's kind of a tough one. Mm Mm-hmm. Is it, is it Ghidorah? I, don't, I think that's wrong, but Ghidorah B? It is not Moby? Ghidorah. It is Rodin. Is it a- yeah. oh, I was going to say that. Yeah, Ghidorah is the three-headed, like, dragon-looking. The, the, the dragon thing, yep. Yeah. Oh, I knew it. Yep. Dang it. Yeah, Good that's, a, that's a tough one. <laughs> also in Godzilla, King of the Monsters, what creature is called... Monster Zero. Ooh, Monster Zero. Is that Ghidorah? Final um, answer? It is King Ghidorah, yes. Okay, King Ghidorah, yeah. Yep. The Alpha. Until Godzilla shows up. I remember, alert. <laughs> remember like, people are so excited when Ghidorah was going to be in the movie. Yeah, it, it was quite a spectacle. They, they made Ghidorah look pretty cool. You well, know, I gotta admit, I don't remember much about the, the second Godzilla movie. Yeah, I I watched it like, more I didn't recently. Wa- didn't watch it as much. Yeah, so I, only, I only saw it once. I think I watched it before uh, Godzilla vs. Kong was the first time I watched it. Okay. So it's a little more recent. That, that's right, yeah. So they have Godzilla and then Godzilla King of Monsters and then the Kong Skull Island movie. Yep. And then Godzilla vs. Kong. Yep. Okay. And now now the show. Okay. Yep. Speaking of Godzilla vs. Kong, in Godzilla vs. Kong, what is the name of the podcast made by Bernie Hayes? I can show you a picture of Bernie Hayes if you want to know who the character sure. is. So this guy here on the right is Bernie Hayes. Oh. That character. <clears throat> That's what I remember. Um... Give me the multiple choice. I'm going to need multiple choice. Yeah. I remember. Yeah. So is his podcast called Monarch Mayhem, Podzilla, Titan Truth Podcast, or Godzilla Destroy All Podcasts? Those are all great names. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Oh, like, man. That's really, this, this I really was like also, the Podzilla. Yeah, this was also... I did take... Um, I think this is actually a real podcast. I think I made up the other two, if I remember correctly, but like, all right, let's, I think it's, uh, I'm going to go Titan truth podcast. See. Yeah. Very okay. nice. Yeah. I guess I gave away that this one wasn't <laughs> the answer, well, but, but you got it. Anyways, so you got it. I wouldn't have guessed so, but the, I really like the Podzilla one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, that's funny. When Godzilla first fights Kong, Kong is being transferred to where in order to access Hollow Earth? So this Ooh. is also in Godzilla vs. Kong. He's being transferred. Oh man, where was it? I can't remember. Um, give me the multiple choice. Okay, was man. he being transferred to Florida, mm-hmm. Hong Kong, Greenland, or Antarctica? I feel like it was Hong Kong B. I know why you think it's Hong Kong, because that's where Godzilla first shows up in one of the movies. I think it's Godzilla versus Kong. Oh, but oh. Kong is actually yeah. being transferred to Antarctica. Yep. 
Okay, I'm getting. Oh, you know, okay, I'm I'm remembering the scenes now. Yep. Okay. Yep. Hmm. It's all coming back. <laughs> Okay, the neural networks in whose skull is being used to help control Mechagodzilla? Mm, the bad guy. <laughs> so, so multiple choice. Yeah, so they use it's one of it's one of the monsters. So one of the monsters' skulls is being used as like a neural network oh, to to control yeah. Mechagodzilla. Yeah. Well. <clears throat> I still need the, the yeah yeah. Voice. So is it Rodan, Majira, King Ghidorah, or Muto Prime? Is it Rodan A? Eh? It is not Rodan. They actually use King Ghidorah's skull. Oh really? Yeah. I don't remember that? Okay. Yep, it's like a big contraption in the skull. Oh okay. Man, I need to rewatch it. And then last question. Who is actually controlling Mechagodzilla? Um, and you can't just say the bad guy. <laughs> that, that's a great question, Caleb. Uh, multiple choice me. Okay, is it Madison Russell, Ren Sarazawa, Admiral Wilcox, or Mark Russell? See, Admiral Wilcox? I don't know this one. It is not. It is actually Ren Sarazawa. Oh. So you remember the oh. quote, the nature's are in our control quote? It's his uh -huh. son that's controlling it. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Okay, man, I need to I need to rewatch it. <laughs> yeah. I put in a lot of uh like God uh King of the Monsters ones and so yeah but yep that's it okay so you got 14 points as long 14, as I okay didn't miss any but yeah i think that that's correct so yeah not bad okay. I, mean, I, I mean i wasn't expecting much with with savage you know i'm not an expert on godzilla yeah yeah no i thought you did pretty good okay that was interesting maybe every time we do these it makes you want to watch whatever we <laughs> <laughs> yeah yep